What's good YouTube, it's your boy Vontae two times and I'm back with another video. Today I'll be giving you the best point guard build in NBA 2K19. This build is actually better than the play sharp. So no, the build is not play sharp, it's going to be something totally different. But I'm going to show, I'm going to compare both of the builds and you're going to see what I'm talking about. So this build we're going to be talking about today is the Shot Creator Playmaker. Um, you can keep this build at a 6'3 or 6'4. I personally personally would go 6'4 but keep in mind if you go 6'4 your speed will go down two times so it'll be an 89 if you go 6'4 it'll be a 91 if you go 6'3 so this is a play sharp these are the badges eight gold four silver six bronze and you know you see mid range and deep range that is bronze both of those are bronze on this uh, on this build right here and this these are the attribute caps just keep in mind all of that pay attention to the mid range pay attention to the three uh pay attention to the ball control and yeah pay attention to the speed so pay attention to all of that um lateral quickness is 79 okay so the acceleration I don't know why the acceleration is so low with this build, but you see that 85 acceleration, 91 speed. But that's before you do the wingspan and the weight and all of that. But just off defaults, this is what the other shot creator playmaker build gets. You get 11 gold, 7 silver, and 6 bronze. And look at those badges. You get gold, mid range dead eye, bronze, deep range dead eye, and bronze on the other one was deep range and mid range so that's a up that's a plus right there you get gold ankle breaker like and look at the attributes 88 layup dunking is better the mid range is way better and the three is only one below the play sharp it's only one so anybody talking about this build can't shoot it's not the build it's you and it's that simple ball control 91 the only the only difference and then the speed and acceleration 91 87 the only difference the only big difference is the speed with ball that's what you got to pay attention to but it's not it's not that bad so that's what these two builds look like side by side on default so now i'm gonna go back to the play sharp but i'm actually get into it so with the height we're gonna keep that at six three for, for right now we're gonna keep it at six three for right now All right, and then wait with either one of these builds you you're a point guard so just put the weight all the way down put the weight all the way down and boost that acceleration boost that vertical boost that speed with ball and boost that lateral quickness those are key to these builds so just make the weight all the way down now wingspan we're gonna look at it. We're gonna look at it at the lowest wingspan. So this is what it looks like before we mess with it. And so now we're gonna go all the way down and see what that is. So with the play sharp, the open shot three goes to an 84. Ball control 93, speed ball 91, the mid range 86. And that's what it is again with the default caps. And we we just gonna go down to see and see what the speed is. And this is what it looks like two ticks down from default. This actually what I'll be going with two ticks down from default. So if you're 6'3", it'll be 80 inch wingspan. And then 
If you if not, it'll be like an 81 inch wingspan if you go 6'4. But we're gonna go back to the shot creator playmaker and we're gonna do the exact same thing we just did. Alright, so keep your height, 6'3. And then Okay, so weight go all the way down. And then make the wingspan all the way down and we're gonna see we're gonna see what it look like. So one so the the three for the play sharp went to 84 with the least amount of a uh, wingspan so the three with this one goes to 83 so it's still only one below the play sharp so the three is good that's good but check out the mid-range the mid-range went to 86 for the play sharp it goes to a 93 for this one um and then the ball control 91 and then the uh, speed with ball 88 so with the play sharp the speed ball control is 93 and the speed ball is 91 so keep that in mind and speed 91 acceleration 91 so the speed is good that's good you just gotta what determines this build for you is the speed with the ball it's not it's not a big difference i'm telling you that now this build has the potential to be better than the play sharp because that's all i see right now that's all i see in park and all that is play sharp play sharp this play sharp that but that's not even the best build people only pick that build because it has three point in the name they didn't take out the time to look at the actual build but like i'm t i'm telling you this build is the way to go so with my dude i actually made him 64 and like i said the speed of if you make him 64 the speed will go down two times so it'll be an 89 instead of a 91 that is up to you but everything else lines up perfectly i'm telling you that right now this build is better than the play sharp the shot creator playmaker is better than the play sharp so like i said i'm only gonna make it two ticks down from default as far as my wingspan i do not want my wingspan all the way down because me i'm a defensive type of guy so i do not need midget arms because I, I feel like that's holding me back. If I make it two ticks down from default, I still get a 71 steal, you know, and as far as contesting shot of shooters who I'm guarding, I have a better chance at contesting. So I'm only gonna go two ticks down. I'm not gonna go all the way down my wingspan, but you can go however you want as far as wingspan, that's up to you. You can go all the way down or you can do what I did. You know, if, you, if that, extra three on the extra three attributes on the three point is what you feel like you need then go ahead and uh make your wingspan the lowest as possible but that's not what i need at 80 three point is good for me so that's what you get when you make this build exactly how i made it six four lowest weight two ticks down from default as far as wingspan this is what you get and that's it for this video. Make sure y'all give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're new. And stay tuned for the next video.